Today in history. 10th July 2018. Tense and gloomy. Fam Luang Caves, Northern Thailand. Dear Diary, Today something amazing and scary happened. I was there and saw everything with my own eyes. It's the Fam Luang Cave Rescue. So, first, there's this group of kids from my school called the Wild Boars, and they love playing football. One day, they decided to go exploring in the Fam Luang Cave with their coach. But then, it started raining a lot and the cave got all filled up with water. Oh no, they couldn't get out and were stuck inside the dark cave. I heard that the rescue mission started. Lots of brave people came to help. Even divers from other countries came to join in. The divers had to swim in the dark and narrow passages of the cave to reach them. It must have been super scary. I was really worried for the boys and coach because they were trapped inside for many days without food or sunlight. But guess what? They were found alive. After nine days of intense effort, the British cave divers finally discovered the missing group on 2nd July. They were on a rocky ledge surrounded by flood water. I can't even imagine how happy and relieved their families and friends must have been. To get the boys and their coach out, the rescuers helped them by giving them diving gear and guiding them through the water. One brave diver, Sam and Cunin, sadly lost his life during the rescue. He ran out of air while bringing supplies to the kids. I feel sad for him and his family. Finally, today, after three days and a lot of hard work, all 13 members of the group were brought out safely. Hooray! It was amazing teamwork. Everyone around the world is talking about this incredible rescue. I think this event will be remembered because it shows how people can come together and help each other in difficult times. It's a story of bravery and selflessness. Maybe in the future, people will learn from this and be inspired to help others too. I hope we can all remember to be grateful for the rescuers and send our thoughts to the brave diver who didn't make it.